Okay. Hi, everybody. Okay, so I went to Staple this year. Um, it's still going on. It's actually going on today, but I was only able to go yesterday. I just wanted to show you guys what I got. These comics that I picked up, literally I only picked because of what they look like. I didn't know anything about them before I bought them. Um, I just liked how they looked, the size, how they felt in the hand. This one, it looks like it was hand stapled. And I was obsessed. I love blue and pink. It's my favorite color combination. Uh, I read part of this already. It's so cute. This is the artist. This is her information. I already started following her. She's really cool. She's really nice. And I had the exact change. Um, but yeah, I just wanted to show you the inside of it. I'm not going to go through the whole thing. Uh, you should really buy it. It's beautiful. It looks like it was made with love. And just, ah, the pages are pink and the ink is blue. And that just is so good. I love it. Ah, so cute. Okay. Eee! Yes, I really recommend it. Please get it. This is my first one that I got. Okay, this is the second book that I bought. It's so cute. I like the size of it and I love how thick it was. It was like 25. Um, it's a collection of stories by a whole bunch of people. Um, and it's really nice. The pages are all gloss. I'm not going to flip too much through it. But all the different artists, you can tell the difference between them like right away. And they look so cute. Nice. And all their information is in the back. I didn't get a single like um, business card because there's so many artists in it. But I really like this. And the inside the very first page that it says for maidens and mothers and crones and everybody in between it's so cute but yes very good very excited to read this one yeah okay the next book that i bought was laura dean keeps breaking up with me um i didn't know anything about what this book was going to be about it's by mariko uh, Tamaki and I think she was there they said that she would come back and sign the books in like 45 minutes but I was tired by the time I got around to this book and I didn't stay I should have stayed because I read this on the way back home and it is beautiful this artwork is amazing so everything is in uh, black white and gray and this spot color of like peach and it just makes everything look so cohesive and pop and this thing was only $20 and it's a it's a thick boy it's a thick boy it's perfect bound and the pages are like stark white and smooth and just very nice and I'm like so obsessed with this book this book was really good I'm not done with it I'm mostly done with it but it's so nice so if you can please look her up she's so good I believe this is the artist it's, ah, it's so good it's just amazing I just really love the detail of her artwork and how smooth and free-flowing it is yeah I think this was at a booth for a booth for like a bookstore because they had a lot of other books there but I saw this one and it was pink and I was like of course I have to have it it's really really beautiful so yeah I really recommend it this is the one that I read the most of and it's so good Ugh. okay the last book book that I bought was um, a tiny book um, written by Hansel Moreno Hansel Moreno uh, this is a witch's laugh. I really love this story. I have the compilation book that it's from, uh, but I saw the single version and I had to have it also. And also this version is in black and white. Um, I'm not going to flip through the whole thing, but the art in here is very beautiful. 
I can't recall the artist's name right away, but uh, this was the compilation book that it came from. And this book is so amazing. It has so many wonderful artists, and Hansel wrote almost all the stories in here. I don't know if he collaborated with anybody in the writing process. Oh, let me see if I can just show everybody's Instagrams, their Twitters. This is like everybody that worked on the book, all the creator information. Um, and I won't flip through the whole thing. I'll just show you guys a few pages, but it's so rich in color and so beautiful. And it's so rare to have books that have full color. Um, and when you have it, it's just so nice to have something that's so like loved and taken care of. It's just so beautiful. The artwork is so great. Um, let's see. The characters and their shapes this is so good. But yeah, if you guys have the chance, I would pick this up. But yes, Hansel Moreno. Moreno. Very, 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 very good. Um, I got this last year, but yeah, I got the single version. I would actually buy the single versions of all of these stories. These stories are so good, um, and the art in The Witch's Laugh is so good. Um, but yeah, so awesome. Yeah. Okay, I just wanted to talk about the pens that I got at Staple. The first pen I got was this one. I was so obsessed with this sticker when it came out for Sprinkle Bat. I was just like, I need it so badly in a pen. And a year later, here it is in pen form. And it's the biggest pen that I have. This one's probably the biggest size wise, like side to side. But up and down, this one's taller than even my little cat that I got last year at Staple from Lux Cups. Um, yeah, this is a Sprinkle Bat pen. I love Sprinkle Bat. Um, I got her unicorn donut ones before, but this one, this is, I feel it in my soul. It's so good. Um, then I received, I got this one, the rice ball pen from uh, Shark City Slicker. I love her, she's amazing. I got this pen from her last year. And since then, she's released this one and this one, the little shrimpy pin. Oh, it's so cute. They're so cute. I love the way she does her eyes. I love her colors. They're so good. Um, and I also got this third one from Shark City Slicker. It's this, the, the other girl version where she's wearing a shark hood instead of the tiger hood. She had this out. I think in this style with like a silver outline I think from before but back then I couldn't afford it so I didn't get them together but I finally got it I think in the re-release of the gold outlined one it's so cute I love her so much uh, and the rest of my pens I've already had them um, but these if you haven't seen my previous content or whatever uh, these three right here are from Lux Cups. These all are from Shark City Slicker. This is from uh, Punky Pins. These two are from Sugar Bones. They're Sailor Moon Pins. Um, they're always together. Yes. This is from Erin. Oh boy, I don't know how to say your last name. Um, Erin from Staple. Uh, you know who you are. I can't remember what your last name is. Um, he's such a good artist. I have one of his prints hanging up on my wall. He's really good. This was like a random $3 Fiesta pen. I love Batman. I bought this pink bat in lieu of a Batman pen because I just couldn't find one. And then for Fiesta, I found this Batman one. Uh, but yeah, those are the pens that I was able to get. These four. This one's choo choo. And it's so good. I love my bag. I'm afraid to put some on the pockets, but that's probably where it's headed. Um, I was able to fit them in the corners over here. 
Uh, it's probably going to take the whole thing up, but that's okay. I love this backpack. It's my favorite that I've had. Um, I got it at Walmart for like 15 bucks. It was so good. And yeah, anyways, those are the pins that I got. And for art, I didn't buy any art this time. Uh, but my friend, Tony, she came with me and she bought me this. My little going away present. I'm moving to Washington. Um, but she saw this and she got it for me. And I freaking love Lizzo. Lizzo is my everything. It's the only little piece of art that I have from staple but yeah it's so good I love it so much I can't wait to put it in a frame um ah, just so good but yeah that's basically what I got at staple this year um I didn't get to table this year I I don't know if I'll be able to next year because I'll technically be leaving in Washington but I've been going to staple for four years in a row and I love it. It's just so good. Like, it's just so awesome. Oh, this is some stationery from, uh, from Shark City Slicker. That's really cute. There's like a million little pages of cute little buddies all over it. Um, but yeah. Oh, anyways, Staple is such a good convention. I love Staple. And yeah. Uh, thanks for watching. See y'all later. Bye.